Hi, my name is Rachel and I'm a member of the All Nations Christian Centre family and this is my thought for the week. So a lot of the time I think we can be quite careless sort of with our words, you know, whether that's a spoken word or whether it's maybe a text or an email that we kind of wish that we could recall or, or delete before the person sees it. And, you know, we do throw away words, I think, quite carelessly, giving not much thought to their meaning. But God, God's word, he is intentional with his words and God says what he means and is true to what he has spoken over us. And so today's thought of the week um, is taken from Isaiah 43. And there are words in this scripture that if we're not careful, we can just glance over. Um, but this is actually God's heart. This is his thoughts and feelings towards his children, towards his people. His words convey a depth of love that is so hard to comprehend, a love that surpasses all human understanding. You know, God who created everything sees us as the apple of his eye. His own words say in Isaiah 43, he says, fear not for I have redeemed you. I have called you by name, you are mine. When you pass through the waters, I will be with you and through the rivers, they shall not overwhelm you. When you walk through fire, you shall not be burned and the flame shall not consume you. And then God goes on to tell us about his love for us. And he tells us, you are precious in my eyes and honoured and I love you. I mean, there are so many promises and amazing truths in these words. But, you know, from this, we can see that we are precious meaning that we are of great value to God, not to be treated carelessly. We are honoured. We are regarded with, with great respect. He is with us in every situation and circumstance. You know, what great love. He then says those three wonderful words. He says, I love you. And how did he show us that love? He gave us his son, Jesus, his son who took our place on the cross, died for us and rose again to redeem us. He exchanged his life for ours to bring us back into that loving relationship with Yahweh, Father God. And so, you know, this just reading these words this week has just really encouraged me. And I just hope that it encourages you to, you know, in our day to day, we can sometimes forget the enormity of God's love, the height, the width, the depth, the breadth, you know, today and every day, we can remember that God loves us. He is with us. We are precious to him. We are honoured and we see how much we mean to him. We see his love in his son, Jesus. So I hope you have a good week. Take care and God bless.